Greetings everyone. So today I will show you how to set up your Pyvex wallet. So first of all you need the wallet, of course. So you go to pyvex.org website, right here. Uh, slash wallet to go to the wallet page. Um, I will post the link in the description. Uh, then you press the Windows or Linux, uh, GitHub, Mac or Raspberry Pi um, icon for whatever OS you're running on. Alright, so you just press on this Windows icon and then download the zip file. I already have it here so I don't need to download it. Alright, show in folder. Right here. Then you just double press on it, extract all. Uh, and then you're gonna get this folder. Uh, just go in Windows uh, 64 or 32 depending on your system um, and then for your first time you want to use this setup unsigned.exe uh, executor alright so this is the installer just next next install and then it's going to install by itself you just wait a few seconds alright next and then you just do run alright uh, while it's starting, what you should do is make a shortcut of the DXC uh, executor and drag and drop it on your desktop so it's easier for um, you later on to open it and close it, whatever. Alright, uh, you might notice here I'm already synchronized so I'm gonna change this right now um all right blocks okay so when you start you won't be synchronized at first of course you will have to download the whole blockchain uh, slowly and whatever. Um, also, when you open your f when you first open your wallet, what you want to do is encrypt your wallet. All right, mine is already encrypted, but what you can do is enter passphrase. Uh, well, this is my current passphrase, but when you do it f uh, first, you just have new passphrase and repeat passphrase, and then you encrypt it. Uh, it might crash or stop responding, just wait a few minutes or two it's gonna tell you uh, that it needs to restart uh, to finish the encryption so you press OK and then you just let it uh, close afterwards when you open it uh, it's gonna be encrypted so it just unlock and then make sure to check this for anonymizing and stacking only and then just enter your passphrase. Uh, I think I messed up. Alright, just enter your passphrase. And then you can see here it says what is encrypted and currently unlocked for anonymization and stacking only, which is what we want. Alright, so now that's done. As you can see here, I am one year and five weeks behind, and that's no good. So what we're going to do is close the wallet and always wait for this to shut down. All right. And now uh, we want the bootstrap. So we just go to this link and this link will be in the description down below. So we press on download. Are you going to download the data, the zip file? I'm just going to pause it. Uh, cancel it actually. All right. And then you go in your download file once it's downloaded you're gonna get the da -da -da zip with blocks and chain state um, once you unzip it you're gonna get data and you need to copy these two folders uh, copy and again go in uh, percentage percentage uh, in between app data and PIVX or just do 
um, user your username add data roaming pivx all right once that's done control p uh, control v for paste and then just wait uh, until it pastes Alright, I'm going to replace the if. Alright, once that's done, you can close your browser. And then use the shortcut we have here. Might take a few seconds to load the whole blockchain in the folders. That's what it's doing right now. Alright. All right, it's coming up. There we go, and bam, we're only nine hours behind. And always remember to unlock your wallet. And the reason why you always want to unlock your wallet, anonymization and stacking only is, well, first of all, if you don't unlock it, you won't be able to stake, which means you won't get rewarded for. Uh, the PIV coins you have in your wallet and also um, make sure to check this um, to check this so anyone that passes by and have access to your PC or device won't be able to spend uh, your IP your PIV without entering your um, path phrase. Alright, so that's about it. Um, it might take a while before you get any peers, but um, if you go on Slack, um, actually I'm just gonna uh, show you the link quickly. Alright, slackipv.org. I'll leave this one in the description. Uh, you enter your email address. Once that's done, you just uh, check your email and follow the link uh, it'll give you to join the Slack. Alright, and once you're here, you want to go in channels and search for support, and then you check the pins. And first one here under tools, select edit. And then you can see um, some nodes right here, and you can add the, the those nodes. Let's. Ju I'm just gonna show you where. All right, copy. Um, explore. All right. Again, it's uh, under roaming. So app data. Uh, PI All right. PIVX and then you modify your PIVX compile so edit and then just paste staking one add node and yeah I actually have nodes so I don't really need to modify it so I'm just gonna do no but yeah do it for your first time and yeah, that's about it. Wait a little while for your peers to connect. And right now I have nine connection. I'm up to date. I'm unlocked for anonymization and stacking. I don't have coins on my wallet right now, but I do have some here. As you can see, Shibur, uh 55 so what I'm gonna do is I have um, this okay label I'm gonna ma uh, name it uh, slack tutorial all right request payment uh, address all right so I'm just gonna do uh, Rizra And 55, 55. 
Alright, you want to redraw the red eye, is this correct? Yes. Great, I will continue. Alright. Uh, redraw, okay, and there's the fee, which is barely anything. Actually, point oh 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 one PIVX. Alright, let's see here. Alright, well, total fee. Yeah, barely anything. Alright, now let's see. Should I appear in the wallet soon? Yeah, right here. You can see it. Slack tutorial. Available. Total. Alright. Alright, that's it. Thanks for watching. Hope you helped. Uh, enjoy.